This video is about connecting Bluetooth peripherals to the Honor Magic V2. Uh, I recently did a video about Magic Desktop, so uh, the option to display um, a different version of the operating system when you connect it to an external display. And I was asked if it's possible to connect the Bluetooth mouse or Bluetooth keyboard to the Honor Magic V2. To make a long story short, yes, of course, it's possible. Also, other Android phones are able to connect to Bluetooth periphery. But I wanted to make this video because I think especially foldable phones like the Honor Magic V2 are a little bit of a special animal in this case because they offer more screen real estate uh, on the inner display and this makes them quite useful for using them as kind of a simple and small laptop replacement. Okay, so first let's connect a mouse and Bluetooth keyboard to the phone. We are going into the Bluetooth settings, settings for this. And now I'm going to put my mouse into pairing mode. And under available devices, you can see there is the MX vertical. You just have to confirm that you want to pair with this Bluetooth accessory and it's connected and can be used. We'll do the same with the keyboard. And there it is. There's the Keychron K8. Confirm. And now I have both a keyboard and a mouse connected to my phone. Now we can attach the phone to an external display and then the first thing that will happen is the phone normally, <laughs> because I used it before, will start like this. So it will just display the phone screen. You have to go into this notification and change projection mode to desktop and then it will change to this and the phone then will act as a touchpad and I showed this in my last video. And now with Bluetooth and mouse connected to the phone I can launch a browser, use the mouse, use the keyboard and use it like a small laptop. So this is regarding the question am I able to connect Bluetooth accessories. What I find quite interesting now is if I detach the phone from the screen, um, the mouse and the keyboard will stay connected. So what I can do now is I can use the case with the included kickstand and place the phone like this. And now I have a nice little desktop replacement. So what I find nice is that everything works. So the mouse wheel the mouse wheel is working, um, gestures are working, so I can uh, go back to the home screen when I'm, for example, in Google News Feed. I can use the mouse wheel to scroll. Long press on the home screen is working, so everything your finger does is also working with the mouse. And also the keyboard is working, so um, right, so essentially the Honor Magic V2 with the kickstand becomes a nice little small device that you can use like a mini desktop. So I think that's quite nice. I know that this is not exclusive to the Honor Magic V2 and also other Android phones have the option to connect Bluetooth peripheries. But I think especially for a foldable, that's a nice use case I wanted to show in this video because you have much more screen real estate and also not every phone offers a desktop mode. So I think these two features are quite nice and uh, play nicely together so you can attach it to an external display, work a little bit and then detach it and continue working with the phone uh, when you put it on a table with the included case and the kickstand. I quite like it and this is why I wanted to make this video. And that's it. That was my video about using Bluetooth peripherals 
on the Honor Magic V2 and using the foldable as kind of a mini laptop replacement. Let's discuss in the comments how useful are Bluetooth peripherals for phones or especially for affordable phones. Do you use these functionalities regularly? What are your use cases? And uh, yeah, let's just discuss this in the comments. I would be more than happy to welcome you in one of my next videos. Until then, take care and bye.